Hello, North. This is Hallie. And Gigi. Here are your announcements for Friday, October 28th, 2016. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Here's Mr. Kenyon with the weekly student drawings. Good afternoon, Viking people. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to pick eight cards. And it's going to be a lot of fun. That's 12. Here we go. Our winners are Ryan Bollinger, Meg Coff Coughlin, Micah McDonald, Adrian Albizo, Sophie Bowman, Rory Carlson, and Ruby Henderson. That's only seven. Let's get one more at the very bottom. And our last winner is Aiden McLean. Now for our teachers. Yes, I'm still sporting the cool sunglasses that you can buy from Mr. Nemeth. Teacher winner number one, Mrs. Oblendocker. Number two. She's going to be gone tomorrow, so she forfeits. Sorry, Ms. Benson. The other teacher winner is Schwartzhoff. All right. Way to go. Have a good day. Learn lots. Thanks, Mr. Kenyon. Here's Ian with today's weather. Hello, North. This is Ian with today's weather. It will be cool in the mornings when it's cold. With the high of 59 while it's colder. In the low of 50, it's going to be exceptionally cold, except cooler temperatures in the morning with more rain in the rest of the weekend. Stay dry. Today's record was a fact. At any given time, on average, there are, there are about 1,800 boom-boom storms occurring on Earth with 100 strikes per second. Now back to Holly and Gigi. Okay, on drug use and health, summary of national findings. Tennis. It was a big day on the courts this Wednesday as the seventh grade biking tennis team defended and won their city tennis championship title. We had a great time out there, played well, played fair, and beat out the nearest competition by 12 matches. Sophia took third in girls doubles, Eddie and Chris took first in boys doubles, along with the third place for Trenton and Brett Ben, and Tori and Mason. JJ Barton took first in boys singles without dropping a single game out of nearly 20 games played. Fantastic work, seventh graders. Your coaches are proud of you. You are looking forward to working together again in the eighth grade season. See you on the courts, Viking. Play North Tennis. Library. Seventh and eighth graders, today is your final day to create your Battle of the Books team. If you have been carrying on your team form with you for days or even weeks, today is the day to get it turned into the library. If you have already formed your team, pat yourself on the back because you are one of the 20 of the, your 20 out of all the books teams are here at North. Congratulations, there will be a meeting for all teams coming up soon. In the meantime, keep reading. Thanks for coming to the library to guess the weight of the pumpkin. The pumpkin weighed 13.44 pounds. The first place winner is Cold O, who wins the pumpkin with a guess of 13.57 pounds. Second place goes to Ben Harris, who guessed 13.24 pounds. And third place goes to uh, Camilla C, who guessed 12.9 pounds. Honorable mentions to Casey Q and to Miss uh, Richmond. Come by the library to pick up your prizes. In the rails, today in kickball, Bulldogs play the Juicy Juice. On Monday, Gina's team plays Dean's team. On Tuesday, the Beaters play Cheese. This is a single elimination tournament. You lose, you are out. Here's Hudson and Thomas with North's birthdays. 
Hello, North. I am Hudson. And I'm Thomas. And your birthday for today, North, is Alex P. <laughs> now back to Gigi and Hallie. Thanks, Hudson and Thomas. Thanks, North. Have a ballistic Friday.